Hello student, back again with me, Miss Fanny. Today, we're going to continue our lesson to the second unit, the life cycle of flowering plants. It starts with the subtopic 2.1, why plants have flowers. In this subtopic, you are expected to know that plants can reproduce. What's the word? Let's learn. Yes, every plant has flowers, like example, this pine tree, or this fern, or the moss. These plants, they don't have flower. So, most of the plants, they have flowers, but not all have flowers. Why plants have flower anyway? Is it because it's nice and beautiful? There are different kind of flowers. This flowers is not colorful. It is dull. And the flowers also small. This one is quite big. And how about these flowers? Some flowers have nice scent, while the other they don't have nice scent. Some of the flowers even don't have scent at all. So no matter what the size, color, or scent, all flowers do the same important job. Can you think of it? You see this plant? This is a banana flower. So when a banana plant produces flowers, the flowers usually last only a few days. Then they wither and fall off the plant. However, parts of the flower stay behind on the plant. This part become the fruits. The seed form inside the fruit and then the seeds grow into a new plant. The new plant grow and produce flowers to form new fruits and seeds. This is another example. This is a corn plant. The corn plants, they have flowers. When the flowers wither and fall off, the part of flowers will remain behind the, on the plant. The part become the fruit, and inside the fruit, there are some seeds that when it fell off to the ground, it will grow again into the new plant. So, flowers help plants reproduce to form a new plant. So this is the important job for every flowers that plants have. Maybe it's beautiful, it's nice decorating and has smell scent, but it for us the flowers job the important super duper important jobs that flower have for the plant itself is to reproduce or to form a new plant. So that's the important job for the flowers. These are some words you need to learn during the lesson. Maybe you heard it earlier. Let me explain it again. The first word you need to learn is scent. Scent is the smell of flowers that you can smell it with your nose. The second one, wither. Wither is when the flowers dry or start to die. And the last one is reproduce. Reproduce means when the plants produce flowers and the flowers will form the fruit. And then later inside the fruit, there are some seeds that when fell out to the ground, it will grow again into a new plant. 
This is what we called reproduce. So during this topic, you have learned that most plants have flowers, but not all. Flowers can be big or small, colorful or non-colored, scented or unscented. And flowers will form fruits. Flowers also help plants to reproduce. Thank you for your attention. See you again next time. Bye. Thank you.